Hello and welcome to JX2. So today we are going to see how to make interactive mapping using DPSIC. So this DPSIC is a very important tool for in JS uh, in remote sensing. So it is an artificial intelligence. The application that leverages machine learning to analyze and interpret spatial data, enabling automated complex spatial analysis tasks using JS platforms, determining data processing and what. It will also generate synthesis from large data sets when you ask any questions related to JS and remote sensing. So today we are going to see how to make interactive mapping by asking some specific questions related to plotting and mapping of data sets. Very insightful, yes. Very insightful interactive maps, yes. As you can see here very insightful uh, interactives for uh, this purpose. So first go to just search deep, deep stick. Yes. Just click on this one. New chat. Therefore, my aim is to create interactive mapping by asking some specific questions related to JS and the remote sensing and uh, with the assisting of uh, generating some codes that will be displayed in, in Python or R. For this purpose, I will be using uh, employing R. Uh, so that, for example, let me write, uh, I want, I want to load 10 most popular cities is of of the world of the world on yes an interactive map interactive map interactive map when let me say this one when I I click click on on the map Yes, on the map, on the map, uh, display, display, yes, the name of, the name of, the name of what, the city, and what, the name of the city, and what, uh, number of, number of, number of published, for the city, uh, rank, yes, let me add a rank, rank and number of population yes population where i wanted to make this interactive map is uh, in my case i will i will be using r uh, r for this for this for this so that this DPC will generate uh, codes to assist uh, to make the um, interactive mapping. Uh, R. So let me click OK. Yes. It's going to think. Look how it's going to think. Okay, the user wants to plot the most popular cities on an interactive map using R. When clicked, each city should display its name uh, right properly. Let me break down how to approach this. So it tries to think the approaches and try to generate codes. Look, step one is to require packages for because if you, you can uh, try for this R or uh, Python uh, as you like. It will generate Python codes very uh, similarly. Yes. Okay, great. For example, yes, different other codes. Let me say this one. Uh, this is fragmented code. Yes. I will, uh, I will go to copy this one, copy this one. Yes, separately. So let me say, give me. Yes, give me. E one general code. Yes. It continues to work. How oh. it transforms us. 
mapping and special analysis okay great okay great okay great rank this one okay so create interactive map so that uh, there is no legend let me add add legend a legend with different colors and display map Because as I explore this, there is no legend here. It's going to add. Great. Okay, great. Legend button. Okay, let me copy this one. Copy this one. Copy. And let me open R. Let me paste this one. Yes. Then select all, run, and let us see the map. Look how this how this interactive map. For example, population tire. Let me uh, change this one population range. Yes, and run again. Uh -huh. Yes, population range it will change. You can change this one bottom right to left top selection of this one. You can turn around. Yes. So it takes three ranges less than 20 million, 20 million to 30 million, and greater than equal to 30 million. So three partitions has been made. So let us make uh, zoom, as you can see here, yes, look, easy, rank, true, so let us make zoom, this one, this is Mexico City, if you click this one, this is what we call it, interactive map, yes, look, Mexico City, rank 5, and this one, this one becomes Sao Paulo, rank 4, population 21 million. Yes, from Africa, Cairo, rank 6, 20 million, 400,084. Yes, uh, rank number 7, Mumbai. Yes, you can see the population number. So, which cities are the greatest numbers? Obviously, shared in green. In green, less the greater than equal to 30 million. For example, let us Tokyo is rank one, 37 million 400,000. Rank one, yes. From less than 20 million, for example, Dhaka, rank nine, yes. Shanghai, yes. Beijing, yes. Shanghai, Beijing, from 
India, Mumbai, Delhi. You can see that how deep or this deep AI is transport of CIS and remote sensing, in particular, and to special science in general. So it assists and it makes very easily and effortlessly. So you can try by your own using this example as a guide. So this is what we have today. Thank you for watching.